guys, it's me, Blind Iris Ari again. So it's Tuesday, and this week's theme is anime. So as you see, like with Sunday and Monday, that they talk about their experiences with anime. So I figured I'd do the same thing. And it's kind of hard because I'm like, I just can't talk off the top of my head about different animes. So I'm just, I have like, a, you know the 30 picture uh, challenge that people do with like animes or like random things? So I'm gonna use questions, so I'm gonna use those, but I'm gonna answer them. Well, some of them, because some of them I legitly do not have answers to. So let me just, so the first question on this list is your very first anime. My very first anime, well there's two categories, animes I watched when I didn't know it was anime, and then anime I watched when it was anime. Um, I think it's Sailor Moon and like Pokemon, because I was watching those around the same time. And then once those like kind of like drifted off the face of the earth, I would watch like Hamtaro and Tokyo Mew Mew and Yu-Gi-Oh! and Digimon and all those animes and then you know I kind of stopped from a period of time and then I think when I moved in sixth grade somewhere I woke up really early and started watching Full Metal Alchemist and Inuyasha. I didn't know what they were. I thought they were like this random cartoon that only showed up at like 5 o'clock in the morning. So I guess this is a really long answer question but pretty much it's just Sailor Moon and Pokemon. But the first anime I knew what it was, it was Naruto. Um, my favorite anime that I've watched so far is Natsume and The Book of Friends. Uh, my favorite male anime character, I have a bunch. But the first one that pops up into my head is really, I love the main character of most um, shonen anime. I don't know why, I just do. Uh, favorite female anime character? Females are really hard for me to relate to because usually they're all like, eh, I, I don't know. But <laughs> my favorite two are Ursa from Fairy Tale and Ymir from Attack on Titan. Um, an anime that you're ashamed of watch. I'm very, I'm a very avid sh shonen watcher. Like I love action anime. I'm not very fan of like romance. So Shibuchara is just like the anime that I'm like. I watched it and I liked it when I'm older. <laughs> um, anime you want to see but haven't seen yet? I've seen, there's a lot. I have this like list of like 30 plus anime that I need to watch that I don't have time to go around and tell you. I don't have an anime crush. Uh, my favorite anime couple is Tomoya and Nagisa from Planet. So it's favorite anime villain, and I think it would have to go with Lelouch from Code Kiosk. I don't know, he's a villain and he's like an anti-hero, but I, I like him. Favorite fighter anime, I have a bunch. Favorite mecha anime, any of the Gundams or Gurren Lagann. Status anime scene, have you seen Clan Ad? <laughs> have you seen Clan Ad um, and Angel Beats? and any of those genre animes because each of them have horrible scenes that make me cry my eyes out. Anime character you're most similar to? I would have to go with Natsume from Natsume Book, Book of Friends because I relate to that character a lot. Like watching that anime just, I just related to him the most. Out of all my characters, usually I choose like the really happy-go-lucky characters. And his character was something that I'm not used to liking, but I just related to him so well that I connected. Um, favorite sidekick, pet, or summoning from any enemy? I'd have to go with oh my god, I, uh, Madara, which is the cat from Not So Made because it's so fat and pervert and adorable. Um, anime that you've seen, you never get old of watching. Um, anime I've seen over and over again is uh, Ghost Hunt. I love that series. It's like one of my favorites. Um, most epic scene ever. I don't want to answer that because there's a lot. Okay, very, very goofy anime. Baka and Test. Saddest anime death. There's a lot I would have to go. I think Clanad and, and Angel Beats are like the top saddest ones. Well, and Angel Beats are all, like all dead. Um, and 
anime you wish was real? I don't wish animes were real because I think I like the aspect of them being fake because if they were real then they'd be like here and now. And the reason I like anime is because it's not here and now and real. Uh, an anime you wish never ended. Uh, Kekyo Hitman Reborn because the ending fucking sucked. It just sucked really, really bad that I just wanted to continue so the ending didn't suck. Uh, one of the best animations in an anime. I really like Guilty Crown's animation. I love all a lot of the animation that's done nowadays, but I really like Guilty Crown. Um, I think that's it, so that's my pretty much questions that I'm answering off this list. But anime is something I've been really, really into for since I think I got really into it in seventh grade. And thanks to our Friday person who introduced me to Naruto, which opened up like this huge gate of things. And sadly, I haven't been watching anime lately. The last an two animes I watched were Hyaku, which is the volleyball anime, and Narigami. But that's my anime stuff. Well. I'll see you next week. Bye. What the hell?